been a little over six months since we find ourselves in this new normal now, and now we're hearing new words. COVID fatigue, COVID malaise. And I have to admit, I understand why they use the word fatigue instead of malaise, because malaise actually sounds like a sauce you would want on your eggs, you know? Hello, sir, would you like the malaise, general or COVID? Hmm, I'll take the general, little extra paprika. Thank you. So how do you know if you are suffering from this malaise? No mask, no physical distancing, that's a sign. Also, you're feeling a little bit nostalgic. And really, who can blame you? Listen, I get it. It's tough not to be nostalgic about, well, when you can double park on any of the streets in this city. Remember that? You would see somebody double park, and then you can still maneuver yourself right beside them. You communicate with them in some sort of international sign language that they understand, and then you'd be on your way. I get it. You miss conversing with people. Me too. Hello. I'll admit it, I'm not much of a hugger, but when this thing is over, oh my, you are all gonna get a big hug from me. Yeah, as soon as I see you, boom, right in there. Because, you know, I understand now, humans, we need, well, that human touch. Yeah, in fact, when this is over, I may even go to a house party. Whoa, I think I may have the COVID. I just said I may go to a house party. I'm gonna need a minute and a hug. Hold me closer, I need to answer. I feel you. You know, when you tell me that you want to be nostalgic about the good old days, I get it. Oh, uh, yes, the good old days. February, when it was minus 40 and nobody had a mask, unless it was for skiing. I get it. But you know what? It's not over, unfortunately, and it's going to take some time. So, we have to obey all the rules and regulations if we want this to end in a good way. And that way, when it is over, we can all meet up and wax nostalgic about the last few months. Stay safe.